Ezi Olam. The ruler of the universe. Zechariah 14 verse 9, and the odd. E. Shall be the only king over all the earth, and in that day there shall be only one kingdom. And also only one sovereign king, and whose holy kingdom shall be here in the world. And it shall be called E's holy new E Jerusalem. And E's name shall be called one. Because, E. E's E Eluhim E. The creator of all things. And E. E's the sovereign ruler of E's Olam. And E Eluya. Whom E's E. The only one. Friends, in the English, language, the name of the odd, E's called E. And whom E's E, the holy one. And the number one is translated to mean E. In the E Hebrews alphabet. And E. And ye can be read from left to right, and which means one. And which means, E. Because E. E's, the holy sacred name, whom E's named holy E. And whom is E. And E. E's the sacred holy name and the name of the Almighty E. And E. Is translated to mean, one. And e, is used as prefixes and suffixes and also affixes and infixes in words. And e, is also used as conjunctions, and as the word and or and, and also as the word, the, in many languages. And e, or ye is being used predominantly in the Chinese language. And also in the conjugation of words and of verbs and vowels, and also as a conjunction of words. And e, is also used to join sentences and clauses, such as the words, ye, and e. And, but, and 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 also. If and also many others. And e. Is used in the Spanish language, and in many other languages and e. Is used in the composition of many alphabets, and also e, is used or is spoken in many languages. And e. Is also used in the construction of words, and in speech, and e. Is used in so much other forms of the spelling of words, and even in many of our names, and also in the names of places, and in the names of animals, and also in the names of other living things. And also e. Ease, the number one in the Chinese numbering system. And there you have it, friends. Ieluya and Ieluhimi are some of the sacred holy names for the sovereign king of heaven. Friends, in the book of Zechariah chapter 14 verse 9, here is a condensed explanation of the quote. And it says plainly that the holy sacred name of the king of heaven, whom is he? He's the owner or the landlord of the entire earth. And that he? The Audis, also the creator of the universe. And that he's name is? He? Whom is called one? And the holy one? And that the name he? means one. And that only e. He's the holy one. Friends, would you please click on the link below to learn more about the sacred holy name e. And also about the holy one, whom is the sovereign one. And whom is e. Whom is the ruler of e's, Olam. Whom is e. The sovereign king of all the heavens and the earth. And whom is e Eluhim e. Whom is e the creator of the entire universe. Thank you friend. There would be several links at the end of this message, and one to the meaning of Olam. And also a link to the Chinese numbering system. Which is reciting the numbers from 1 to 10. And also there would be a link to the E Hebrews Yod which is the divine designation for the sacred holy name of E. The King. The Eternal King of all the heavens and the earth. Whom is E the Holy One? and whose sacred holy name alone is called Holy E, and also the Almighty One, and also the Almighty E. Thank you. Friend, the ancient Hebrews Yod or the letter Y, spells out the letters I and Y, which is spells out the sacred holy name E, which is, E's holy sacred name. Because there's no letter for the J, in the E Hebrews alphabet. So what letter is used for J in the Hebrew language? In the Hebrew alphabet there is no J letter or for its sounds, but only for the letter Y, so, the IPA, the International Phonetic Agency is promoting the letter J, and its sounds, by misleading us, about the letter spelling of the letter Y, 
which is the e Hebrews Yod. And by interjecting the letter J, and the sounds for that letter. Hard to believe, right? How far will Shaitan go to cousin us, by concealing the letter Y? And the divine designation for the sacred holy name of E. Thank you. The end.